Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be doing one of those gift books that I showed you. Um, if you didn't watch it, I'll put a link up there to um, the video of me opening these. Um, but a quick recap, it's just got a basic uh, toolkit and then... Um, I love these. Uh, I got five notebooks. Two of them are just like this one. Now this one is blank. Okay. But what I love about this, if I can find it, is it has a page marker. Get out of the way. So, you know, you can keep your page marked. Um, this is going to be for my mother-in-law. Um, excuse me, so I'm going to make this for her. I'm going to use my pen that I made. I'll st I mean, I'll use everything else that they got, but let's look at the drills. Now, these are all special drills. Okay. So... We've got some really pretty AB teardrops. And, well, this is like a pink. I don't know, it's like a dark pink. It's kind of showing red, but it's more of like a really dark pink. And then my beautiful color, look at that. I love this, these, I don't know, like aquas or, I don't know. This, the vintage blue, I love it. But these are AB as well. And then we've got some pearls. I don't know if you can see that, but they are also AB. And then we got some pretty crystals and pink. And a different shade of pink. Green. And look at that blue. Isn't that blue gorgeous? And then another shade of pink. And then really pretty purple. So, let's get going. I'm going to try to do this. Ouch, bonk. And for the, oops, didn't mean to bonk y'all. I'm gonna try and do this. Um, maybe hold on one second. I guess I need scissors. Okay, so um, I'll kind of sort of do a tutorial um, for those that have never done anything like this before. Um, and kind of explain things a little better. So you got your little green boat and this holds and helps separate and straighten your crystals or your drills, whatever you use them. These are the crystal drills. Now normally you'll have a sheet that'll um, tell you like the number and, or the shape or whatever but here I don't know if you can see that. It'll focus. But you can see, you know, the number seven right here. Okay, so this here will tell you, okay, this one is number seven. So this one actually makes it really easy. You just use the number seven, right? So you just shake your little boat. Okay, and that kind of straightens them out. Just like that right and then you take your wax and you I you ah Allison for these you don't you can't use the multiplacer I'm I have just recently tried the multiplacer I don't know if I really like the multiplacers yet or not um, I'm used to just one at a time but anyhow, so you take your glue, let's see if I can't show you this, and then you just kind of stab it in there until it gets filled. So I don't know if you can see that it's in there, but it is, it's in there. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, so you just lift the plastic up as far as you want. Some people will just take it all off because it is um, pretty small but um, and then you just go with the numbers so 
You just pick them up. And you put them where each number says that they need to be. Just like this. Easy peasy. This is going to be so pretty. So like I said, this one is for my mother-in-law for Christmas. The other one that looks like this is going to be for my sister-in-law. Um, having a hard time seeing because I'm doing it sideways rather than straight on so that you guys can see. I don't know if you can see that. All right. Um, and then the others, I, I don't know. I haven't decided what I'm going to do with the others. Um, I know I want to keep one or maybe I'll... Well, one of them is my daughter's. I, well, I had gotten an owl for her, but for some reason I didn't get an owl. I got something different. So I decided that the other one in... Sorry, it's warm outside, so I got the doors and windows open. But it's kind of got like a, I don't know, a Indian style to it. Um, almost like a dream catcher look. So I'm going to make that one for her, for you know, for her to journal in. But I am having a hard time doing this. It's sideways instead of like in front of me <laughs> anyhow so like I said this one's going to be for my mother-in-law she uh, likes to um, keep her notes you know for addresses or you know this just notes in general so I thought she would enjoy something like this um, I know I would if someone took their time and made me something like this especially how pretty they are I would love it absolutely love it but that's just me I I mean don't get me wrong like who doesn't love store-bought Christmas gifts you know but I think something that someone makes I mean, granted, I'm, I'm not actually making this completely. Oops, I'm totally out. Y'all need to start yelling at me and telling me to get in, in focus. Hold on, let me... There we go. Yeah, yell at me. Tell me to get in focus. But anyhow, so yeah, as I was saying, I, I would love, you know, for Christmas, you know, it be something that was handmade... Oops. Because then, you know, I mean, like I said, oh, as a, that's what I was saying is, okay, it's not 100% handmade because I didn't make the book, but I am putting the, the crystals on it. I'm making it pretty. So, I do have another image for her. It is partially done. I need to get that going. I got my daughters I gotta finish. I got my nephews to finish. Oh my gosh. I have an image of a lighthouse for my father-in-law and I need to work on that one and get that one finished. But I also have things that I'm crocheting for my daughter I decided not to make me anything and decided to um, just make a sweater and a holiday shirt for my daughter um, instead. So Now these books, these books I got are notebooks I got from AliExpress. Um, I will put the link down below if you're interested in them like I've said in any of my videos if I put a link down below I'm not affiliated with anyone so I'm not gonna get any money if you click on it you know because I know some people don't click on links because they're oh no they'll get money no I won't get no money 
I mean, even if it did give, you know, give them some of whatever I was paying for, because you don't get charged for clicking on it, but I don't know. I don't know why people, I don't know. But like I said, so none of mine are affiliated, so you can click on them and I won't get nothing. It's there just to help you, so, you know, so you don't have to go searching for it. You know, that's about it. But, um, I have gotten my sister into diamond painting, and I think that is so cool. Um, I just sent her, she had ordered herself a bigger one, and I don't know what she was thinking for her first image. And it's squares. I was like, oh, sis, no. I mean, I like squares, but squares are a little more tedious to work with, and they do take a little bit longer you know, whereas rounds, you know, if you don't get it completely straight, no big deal, because there's a little straightener tool that you can, and whether you think you got it on straight or not, I still use my straightener, just to make sure that everything is straight and where it needs to be, you know, I'll use my roller first, and then I'll use the straightener, and then I'll roll it again, just to make sure, but... Anyhow, so I got her one that was a partial and not a full drill. And they were rounds, not squares. So, I, have to, I haven't talked to her in a couple of days. So I'll have to see if she's even started on that or not. I don't know. But, um, it's really pretty. I like some partials. I did one, um, in fact, I was, uh, when I was messaging with, um, I don't know if messaging is a word, but commenting with Amy, um, cause she had just done a video, um, the other day and, um, she had gotten some, uh, paintings cause they were on sale for, I don't know. I think she said eight ninety five or something like that, and um, she <laughs> somehow, you know, she ended up getting them. I mean, she backed out. She never hit confirm or anything like that. And I've had that happen to me before. Like if you back out, you don't have, you know, that. And I don't, that's what I don't like about some companies. I mean, you should be able to confirm, you know, you should be able to come and go out of the cart as you please or back out of it as you please and not worry that, okay, you're going to be charged, you know. But anyhow, so back to what I was saying is one of her paintings was of an owl. Um, and I had made that as a gift for my mother-in-law. Um, and it's pretty. Um, I'm trying to see where all the sevens are. <laughs> Looking at it upside down. It, it was, it was really pretty. Um, but I don't know if they were the same size, you know, but I bought mine years ago, like, I don't know, probably four years ago is when I did that painting of the owl. But it was pretty. It worked up super, super fast, so like super fast. Um, now the, what is the one I'm doing? Um, a peacock for her. That one's not working up so fast, but it's so big. Um, I mean, it's partial, but it's still really big. So, anyhow, I'm going to finish working on this, and then when I am finished, I will bring you back, and I will show you the finished uh, product, or picture, notebook, whatever, and kind of review it from there and see how it goes. Okay, so I'm back, and I've got it finished. You see that? It looks so pretty. This. Oops, sorry. 
There is like no sun. It's just really cloudy, so. But, there you go. Didn't take me very long. But I think it turned out super, super, super pretty. Anyhow. So there you go. I hope you guys... My goodness, traffic. <laughs> ah. Anyhow, I hope you guys liked and enjoyed this. And I will see y'all next time. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Um, share if you possibly can. That would help me out a great deal. And leave me a comment. I love you all. And don't forget to smile. And I will see you next time. Until then, bye-bye. Yeah, it's a part of my garden. Oh, here you go. Picture. All right, love you all. Bye.